Uh, so the director of Transit 17, Guy Blayert, um, is quite an eccentric character. He's a funny director. <laughs> You're laughing at me. I'm just agreeing. <laughs> um, very creative and passionate about Transit 17, as are all of the cast and crew. Um, and yeah, the great thing about Guy is his passion for Transit 17 and his vision for you know the, the end product. Um, and when we're on set, we, we all kind of feel that passion and that energy. Yeah. I've got um, to, I've, if you don't mind, I've got a picture <laughs> of him when he's very passionate about what he loves. Don't you guys can can see that? That's Guy being very very passionate. <laughs> um, so Guy's new name is now Doc. Um, <laughs> Well, no, uh, guys, guys, brilliant is is great. And um, one of the things about working on an independent project is that you've got to wear many hats. Um, we had this this discussion earlier, didn't we? Um, and guy is wearing many hats on this product, um, or you know, this production. Uh, so hats off to him because he's doing a really great job. No pun intended there, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's. Uh, I mean, I've, obviously, I've come onto the project a little bit later on, and the, than the rest of the crew and stuff. Um, but yeah, you know, he's, he's, you know, you can see how hard working he is. <clears throat> you can see what, what, where he wants to go in his vision, how animated he gets when when he's talking about the project. You know, and it, it just in, in, inspires confidence into you. The fact that he's got he's got so much passion for something that is so close to his heart. You know, this is this project's his baby, um, and he's the one that's put it together. Um, and it's just nice, nice, to, nice to see someone with that much focus and determination to to, to make sure everything's done properly. Um, sorry. What did you say? I'm working with you. I'd have to get both of you. Um, I would like to see the whole thing, the the final end product. Um, it's it's always nice to see. Well, it's always good to see, you know, when you're when you're watching the takes back and things, and you kind of get an idea of what the scene was like and the emotion and the atmosphere and the intensity. But when it goes into the edit and then it's graded and then the music's added and the scenes are kind of cut together, um, I, I'm just really looking forward to seeing the story come together. Not necessarily, you know, any particular scene. I've been able to, I've been fortunate to be able to see com a couple of the scenes already um, in post production. Um, so that's been great, um, you know, the quality and the look and everything is fantastic. I'm really looking forward to, again, seeing the whole story come together. Um, and in particular, if, if my if I pulled my character off uh, in the way that I wanted to portray her, um, I want to see the, the shift in my character from this sort of cold bitch to this, you know, more sort of warm, human-like character.